Scott from the Javelin Tech team demonstrating some new functionality added in SolidWorks 2015. There's been an enhancement to the Smart Dimension tool when adding some angular dimensions. So when I go to my Smart Dimension tool and I select this line here, if I want an angle from the horizontal or vertical, I would have had to pick up a horizontal edge or a vertical one and get the angle dimensions from there. Or you could have grabbed three vertices as well. The other way you could have done it is add a construction line and dimension from there. But new in 2015, you can select an edge and a vertex and it brings up these arrows where you can choose which one you want to dimension from. So I can choose the vertical and you can see how it snaps to the 70 degrees from the vertical dimension. And this carries through over into the drawing file as well. So if I go and open up the drawing, I can use the same smart dimension tool and it doesn't matter if you select the vertex first and then the edge. Either works, it brings up the quadrant, and you can select which direction, and you can place your dimension using that imaginary line.